In this video, I'm going to show you how you can automatically set up your worksheet for colors to be counted, colored cells to be counted. I have previously shown you how you can count colored cells with a function, but in this way we've set it up so that you don't have to keep running the function. You can have it set up for when you change the values, the values will change, the count of the cells will change. These are the sales, and if, I have, if they're below $2,000, they, they turn red. If they're above $3,000, they turn green. And if their expenses are more than 10% of their sales, then their expenses are highlighted in orange. So let's count, button this is tied to my macro. And so there you see we have our two, two, and three. Now, if we wanted to um, change one of these, let's say instead of $90, he spent, uh, spent $120 here. Now, um, the cell will automatically change colors, but the count will, will not change. So you just click your button again, and there you have your, um, your cells automatically, or the cell count automatically changing. Let me show you how I, first of all, I formatted these cells. For the F column, it's just a matter of me selecting the, the range of cells. I've gone on the Home tab to Conditional Formatting, and I go highlight cell rules and I say greater than um, 3000 is green and I go less than 2000 is red. For the expenses, I used a formula to uh, conditionally format this. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight this. And what I'm, I'm going conditional formatting and I go to new rule and then I select use a formula to determine the rule. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you what the formula looks like. So we're going to conditional formatting. We're going to manage rules. And here you can see it. And so we'll go to edit rule and you'll see how it should appear on the screen here. And so I have if G2 is greater than, so the value of G2, if it's greater than 10% of F2, then you're going to turn it, uh, turn it orange. So now let me walk, walk you through the code. So my, my code is called auto count color and I've declared two cell range and cell range two is ranges. I've target cell one, target cell two and target cell th three as ranges. Target color is long, count as long. C is a range and that's like the cell in the ranges. What I've done is I've set cell range equals to the F column. So that would be F2 to F14. For cell range two, that would be the G column. And that's where we're calculating the 10%. And so that's uh, G2 to G, G14. Target cell one is my A4, and that's the red background color that you have here. And then target cell two is the green color that you have for A5 and target three, target cell color three is the 10 more than 10 percent it turns that's the color that's on the orange cell here so now to calculate the before what we're doing is we're going a uh, target cell color equals target cell one which is this one display color interior so that's the a4 now if the cell in the cell range for each cell in the cell range which we have described up here if cell display format interior color looks is the same as target color, then count equals count plus one. And next C, and it keeps going through that loop. And now it calculates before equals count, and then it displays it in uh, B4. Now we'll do the same thing for above. And um, we've changed the target cell one to target cell two. And we do the same thing. And now I've count, I've changed it to count one because I didn't want to increase count. So I'm count one. And so count one equals above and range B5 equals above. And the third one is target sun. So we have target three, which is this one. And now we have uh, changed the cell range. Now we're doing the cell range for G here. And the same thing is we count the colors. We've gone count the color two, so it doesn't keep adding to one or the or the other. And then uh, more equals count range two, and then B8 displays more. I will, of course, include 
the code in the description of my videos. Please subscribe.